<laughs> hey, yo, dudes, how you doing tonight? Oh my god, it's a furry. Hello. Yo, hi. <laughs> yeah, it's an actual furry. Are you guys furries? Uh, no, I'm not furry. I didn't think so. So, what's it gonna bring you to furry makeup tonight, bud? Uh, I can't really tell you the truth. It's why not? Just... <laughs> Wait, why can't you tell me the truth, bro? I don't like furries, though. Okay, okay, so you don't like furries. What don't you like about them? Um, and it takes you way too far. Sir, I can't really hear you or your friend. He's too far from the mic. <laughs> hey, yo, don't do that. <laughs> yo, it's okay. He's, he's young. Don't worry about it. I'm sick. Furries take you to And y'all like dog uh, so, eh, no, 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 not really. So, like, furries is like a hobby thing, kind of. Like, we like anthropomorphic art. Wait, huh? Yeah. Like, whatchamacallit, it's a hobby. So, like, it's kind of like skateboarding, hockey, all that kind of stuff. Like, I dress up like this for absolute fun, stuff like that, but I'm a professional. Like, Milan, I look like a chemist. So, like, it's yeah. just a hobby, bro. Yeah. Well, how else do you expect to pay for a $6,000 suit, bro? Six thousand dollars? Yeah, you haven't even seen the rest of it, bro. Like, check it out. Yeah, <laughs> like, dude, like the majority of furries like run the internet, and we do like tons of IT work and shit like that. Like, if you were using a, a like a UI system, are you playing a video game? Nine times a ten, a furries worked on it. You can see. Couldn't hear you, bud. Can you see? Yes, of course I can. How many things I know? <laughs> yeah, I see your fingers, bud. Hi. Wait, can those eyes move or no? Yeah, of course I can. Bro! <laughs> dude, it's an extremely intricate suit, dude. It's a really high advanced one. All furries are bad, eh? No, no. <laughs> like, dude, the majority of furries are pretty chill. Like, it's just like the 15 year old furries that are just like, eh, we're edgy, we're a woo, all that kind of bullshit. But, like, bro, normal furries are like super chill, bro. Explain me, why do you drop six racks on a suit? I'm sorry, what? Why do you drop six racks on suits? Because uh, these suits need to be custom made by a professional. So, like, you see every one of these stripes, they're hand tailored in. The stripes on the back, they're UV reactive fur, dude. They glow in black light and shit. Like, this stuff needs to be done by a professional. What the hell? Yeah, dude. Hey, I want to know more about this, bro. Nah, I need to know more. How much time do you got? I got as much time as you want. Ask me any question, bro. I don't even know, bro. You, 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 you just answered questions that didn't even come up. <laughs> it's all good. Where my walking is going? How long does it take? Yeah, what case? Oh, okay. So typically, it's, if an artist is working on it, it takes a month to make it, but generally you're in a queue for about a year and a half to two years because there's just so many people wanting these things to be made. You typically have to wait two years to get one done. <laughs> yeah. Um, couple yeah, days. You have? Uh, so this is my first one, stuff like that. I got it uh, last year, stuff like that, um, at a convention called Texas Furry Fiesta. Uh, we met this furry. He was, he was like wearing a VR, a VR body jacket. Oh yeah, the like, models. Yeah, that's the new fad for furries. Yeah. He was chill too. I think he was like a little drunk though, but. Yeah, they probably are. Real talk, you've met that chill dude. You're meeting this chill dude. Like, this is what the majority of the fandom is. Like, we go into discords, we are all like chill with each other, stuff like that. You guys really only see like the outside pieces of like, oh, there's that cringy thing. The ones that blow up on like uh, Reddit or stuff like that. You see the cringy stuff, but the underneath is all like super chill. Oh, 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 what's the inside of the mask look like? Oh, uh, so inside of it, it's like a foam head. It's kind of like, have you, do you play any sports? Uh, I try to. Okay, so like it's an inside, it's very similar to the inside of like a hockey helmet or like a football helmet. So you have foam around the insides of that, and then you have like a, the visor of what you see through. Have you ever took it off? Well, yeah, of course you take it off, but like you have to take off the majority of the rest of the suit to get it off. I mean, like, have you took it off like during like what you're doing right now? Yeah, 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 well, you take breaks, stuff like that. Like, this gets, because you're wearing, like, so many layers, stuff like it gets hot. So, like, I got a fan on me that's blowing on me. There's a fan built into the muzzle, so there's cold air being blown back in through here, stuff like that. Some people have, like, cold suits. Yeah, there's a, there's a fan, like, inside the mouth that blows air. I, I can't hear what your buddy's saying. I'm trying to pull my wall piece. Oh, you know what I... All right, well, hurry up before that 
Your phone's at three percent. Hurry, bro. So you you've taken off your mask before, like let's say you were a random size me. You taking your mask off, they see your face. Yeah, of course, yeah. Well, like I have a belly cloth underneath there to like uh, you know insulate, but yeah. A what? I, would, I wear a belly clava underneath it to insulate so they keep my like my hair off the suit so like uh, for like the sweat to keep off of it uh, so yeah but you see my face yeah a belly clava oh, yeah yeah it's a, so isn't there's isn't that like those those black all black like ski masks with the yeah like very similar but they're designed to keep you cool there's a um, technology out there that keeps you cool while you're wearing stuff like this that makes sense yeah so uh, another question what Dude, I don't even know what I'm trying to say this in the most respectful way. Like, hit me, no, hit me with the disrespectful way and I'll go from there. Are, are afraid, like, what's, what's our sexuality? Okay, very interesting question. Are gay? Yeah, so, so here's the thing. Majority of them are LGBT. So they're lesbian, gay, um, all that kind of stuff like that. And then there's maybe about 5 or 4% of them that are heterosexual, stuff like that. The reason is uh, that through art, a lot of furries are able to express their sexuality when they're not able to express their sexuality in normal life. So like if a friend of yours or like somebody in your school was just like, hey, I'm gay, stuff of like that, they're most likely would get picked on and stuff of like that by some members of the community. Oh, bye. Hey, yo, how you doing tonight? Yes, what the, yes. Hi, yes. hi. Uh, so, uh, my amigo, uh, I got banned for no reason. I'm pretty sure we met before, right? Yeah. Uh -huh, I was oh, the, you, the pair that are asking questions. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we got cut off. I'm not sure what happened on your end, but like, yeah, we got cut off. Uh, I got banned for no reason. Ah, that's what happened. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Ah, uh, you were asking me questions about furries. Um, and you were asking about LGBT, and long story short, um, whatchamacallit, we do, like, there's a lot of LGBT members in the furry community because they can express themselves through art in that way. Um, TLDR, if they were expressing themselves in high school, they get bullied, therefore they express themselves in furry and through art because they won't get bullied. That makes sense. Yeah. So, like, uh, people are just looking to have a good time, and they're not going to have a good time if they're doing stuff that makes them a target in high school. Therefore, they come to communities like this, or like uh, the anime community, or like the Star Trek community, or different communities where they'll feel more accepted. There's furries in the anime community? Oh, dude! Furry, uh, the anime community made furries, straight up. I didn't even know there was a Star Trek community, bro. Yeah, no, dude, there's whatever, like, there was, um, like, the Doctor Who community. There's, like, whatever, like, media is out there, there's communities built around it of, like, hundreds of thousands of people that love it. But it's just hobbies for us. Do y'all ever have any straight people that join? Yeah, yeah, so hi, hi, I'm straight. Oh, you are? Well, yeah, well, heteroflexible, but straight enough, like a 99.9. .9. Oh. Yeah. Gave it, you need a good job to be able to afford a suit like that? So you can uh, uh, finance. So if you want to like afford a suit, but you have like uh, like some like uh, much well, it's a luxury, right? So it's like, can you afford a car? If you have a bad job, probably, but you have to make payments over time. Same thing with a spur suit. It's a luxury. Oh, yeah. And you don't need a fur suit to be a furry. All you have to do is enjoy the art and say, "Hey, I'm a furry," and you're automatically an R1. Oh, I was just about to ask you a question too. Like, what do people have to do to like? Be a professional. Um, well, technically, to be a professional in anything, you have to get an education, put the work experience in, and you know work through the job market stuff. Like that being a professional in anything, um, you need a lot of experience, a lot of education. So stay in school, kids, <laughs> kind of deal. Is there education for uh, furries? No, 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 no. So I'm a professional outside of furry. Furry is a hobby. Oh yeah. 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 No, so there are people that do furry as a profession. They do like YouTube. They do like Twitch. They do uh, like, uh, um, oh, like, my God. yeah, they do like dance competitions where they make money for doing that. There's so much things that you can do in furry. They sell art. Like they're artists. There's lots of things that you can do professionally in furry, but furry itself is just a hobby. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of like saying, how can you be a professional basketball player? Well, you can play the game, or you could be the coach of the team, or you could uh, like do all the merchandise for the team. Like, there's lots of things that you can do with it. But some people just play uh, basketball for a hobby, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, nice talking to you. 
Yeah, I thought you do. I'm glad we caught back up because like I was so mad that it got, got you guys banned. Yeah, that's why I thought too. I thought your internet just cut out because like we were mid-conversation. It wasn't like you skipped. Yeah. All right. Well, hey, you guys have a good night, okay? You too. All right. Bye.